T-Birds just happen to be watchers of my shit. My name is Jimmy Pink. Rest in peace, Luke Perry. fucking day I am legitimately fucking hurt over Luke Perry's death but the show must go on and we are here to talk about the first look of RuPaul's Drag Race season 11 episode 2 before I get into that I don't got a fucking lighter so movie magic what we have here is a mini challenge. What else is new? What I am shocked about is, is how unnew, I'm not going to use this, how unnew this challenge is. So we are doing the celebrity photo bomb like we did last year. Um, I didn't write any of those down because it's dumb. Um, however, out of everybody's pictures, I would definitely say I felt like Brooklyn Heights definitely should have been in the top. And Silky then just got butt booty ass motherfucking naked. So sure, she can be the second top. Um, I'm jumping around a little bit, like I always do. Welcome to my channel. <coughs> um, the gag of Vanjie, like you don't talk about Guantanamo. <laughs> Whatever she said, Guantanamo, Guantanamo. She got me not being able to pronounce Guantanamo Bay. Bitch. Um, with Soju leaving. Um, I want to talk about, before we get into the mini challenge in the teens, we already did that. Scarlet. Bitch, how dare you say if you feel your own oats too much, you forget his other oats. Bitch, I feel like that's you. Were you talking to a mirror? Because bitch was mad she ain't win. I mean, your dress was alright. But you should have even been in the top fucking two. It should have been Brooklyn and Akira. Bitch. And if the judges would have clocked Motherfucking Raja's reference, which was Rainbow Bright. She might have been in the top. My girl, um, Ariel. Giving me Laganja tees. Would have been in the top over you. Like, it was cute. But it was basic and it was plain. And I love the fact that Brooklyn and Vanjie co-signed. It's holes in your shit. <coughs> So did you get a little bit too ambitious, girl? Did you have a little bit too much fucking fabric? Or not enough and you had it holding on for dear life? Maybe you shouldn't have made a gown, mama. Anyway, um, I don't know who the other black girl judge is, but I fucking live for Bobby Moynihan. So I am here for him being a judge, and I think he is going to be fucking fun. And it's for an acting challenge. It's probably going to be comedic, so good judge. Um... Silky decides she wants to play fuck, Mary kill, and they was all going to kill Silky, girl. They, they, they had it officially with Silky ass. Um, but Brooklyn's pitch, bitch, that's a dancer, bitch. That bitch said, and just had her legs, oh, bitch, mm-mm. I can't do it without a man holding them bitches apart like that. TMI. But, bitch, that was fucking everything. Like, I was here for that. Like, y'all better watch motherfucking Brooklyn. I already told you. You know I'm hashtag team everybody black. But I'm here for Miss, Miss motherfucking Vanjie. I just want her to do well because that's the bitch. But Brooklyn Heights? Y'all better watch that bitch. Um, anyway, so we're doing these black movies. Oh, Rue, now you want to celebrate black, black cinema? Uh, at least we ain't have to talk about Star Booty. But, um, it is Good God Girl Get Out and Why I Gotta Be Black Panther with all drag queen cast. So, because Brooklyn and Silky won, Brooklyn's team is Nina, good fucking pull, Raja O'Hara, Honey Davenport, Sugar Kane, Plastique Tierra, and Ariel Versace. Yes. <laughs> um, um, Silky got Akira, Vanjie, Mercedes, Evie, and Kahana. Um, I 
Um. Did Silky pick all the minorities? Because, come on, Vanji Puerto Rican, I don't know what y'all do, but in Ohio and most of the, the East Coast, Puerto Ricans is niggas too, okay? So, did you pick all black people? Because I'm just counting Vanji in there, as ghetto as she is, let's count her. Because you got stuck with Scarlet, bitch, and didn't nobody want Scarlet. Could it be that we aren't seeing the edit of it? We're seeing a little bit, a little sprinkle of it. But is Scarlet getting the villain edit? And like I said, based on these, you know, because we get saturated with the drag race shit now, so we didn't see the build series and other things, just based on how the girls interact with Scarlet. I don't think the girls like her that much. I don't know when she's going home, but it don't seem like she will like, at least not as of now. Anyway, the runway look Friday, I'm not going to spoil it for you, but for the people that gave me the good look, thank you. The outfit is almost ready. I got to do a couple more things, um, and I hope you guys like it because it's not very, very draggy, but it's very, very on topic and on brand. So I want to thank each and every one of you for supporting my channel and continuing to allow me to do these costumes because if it wasn't for you, I would not be able to do this. So I want to thank each one of each one of my patrons, people that donate to my PayPal, as well as people that donate to my lives. Fuck it, we might go live tonight. Um, that information is up there and as above is so below. While you're down there, you want to see the full look Friday. Instagram and Twitter, they're always posted there and all that is down below too. While you're down there doing all that, make sure you like, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you can see when all of my drag-related videos are available because season 11, y'all getting three videos a week. Don't know if y'all figured that out yet, but that's what's going to fucking happen. So, you want to know when those come out, hit that notification bell. And as always, I do respond back to all comments, eventually, <laughs> usually within the week. So, I love the comments. I'm here to kiki about Drag Race, so I love your comments. I appreciate your comments, and I comment back. So, please leave a comment down below as well. And if you didn't like the video, click the dislike, because to YouTube, it's all the same. Keep it crazy. Deuces. I was going to say some smart-ass shit to a smart-ass bitch to watch my channel, but I'm living my best life. I ain't going back and forth with you bitches. Deuces. Hey yo, I dog these niggas like Girl's best friend, right? Rent 10, 10, right? Haunted by my past, same shit, different mask like Scooby Dooby Doo. Where are you? But I spotted you out like Spud McKenzie Figured out the game like the Bloodhound Gang I thought you was my friend, you broke my heart again What well, a game done switched, if you a dog, I'm a bitch